track. No, no. So uh, I think many people, many economists uh, will totally disagree with you that uh, trying to measure innovation yeah. in the ICT field just by patents is, is mis uh, misguided. Yeah. No, uh, I, I fully agree. This was just some indicators, and I know that, uh, and that's what I said, uh, a very large share of innovation is very difficult to measure. <laughs> but even if you take other metrics, I, I didn't want to enter into the metrics because the message is not, the key message is not how to measure, it's how do we enter into a more dynamic entrepreneurial culture. Uh, but if you look at uh, software expenditures, IT expenditures, if you look at that, Europe is at 60% to 70% the relative expenditures in the US and in Japan. So for any metrics I, I, I use, uh, education in that field, uh, uh, IT professionals in that field, uh, capital investment, software investment, R&D expenditures. In all these fields, the relative efforts of Europe fl fluctuates between 60 and 75 percent, the relative efforts in the US and in Japan. So we do less, we should do more. We have a couple more questions, uh, Pina. Uh, gentleman in the second row, hand up there. software. I, I think pure software patents are dangerous because except if we can identify very easily, well we, the examiners, the prior art. Then if the prior art can be identified, but this is related with, uh, with ex ante disclosure. So that's the problem of ex ante